Alright man, back at it with another Brock Purdy video. Absolutely destroyed the Eagles this past Sunday on the road, in the rain. Obviously had a little bit of a slow start, but after that, Brock Purdy played like he's been playing all season long. So I wanted to go into the film, break it down, see what he was able to do right, and see how the 49ers were able to dot up this Eagles defense. So without further ado, let's just hop right into it. Alright, first play here, going to be pretty simple. All you got, little motion across. Just getting like a little return route here. Got Debo coming on a dagger. Got Kittle coming on a seam. Then on the backside, you just got a little five-yard out. If you got the five-yard out, let's take it. Darius Slay is playing way off. Brock Purdy sees that. He knows he's going to go there pre-snap. Don't make it harder than it needs to be. Easy drop. Good timing. Get it out on his chest. And let let uh, IU get a little bit of yardage after the catch. All right, that last play got us out of a second and long and got us into a third and short. And all the 49ers have right here, they have Christian McCaffrey coming on a little option route. And that's what Brock Purdy wants to work here. And they have uh, Brandon Ayuk. I think he's running to go, maybe a comeback, but he ends up falling. So what Purdy looks at here, he looks at the option route, it's covered. He comes back to his outside, whatever that was going to be, and Brandon Ayuk falls, so he has to come off of it. But it is a great job right here, not panicking. It's third and short. You need about two yards. See, Brandon Ayuk falls. Christian McCaffrey's not open. They bracket CMC. Not open. Stays poised. Keeps his eyes downfield. Finds George Kittle for the first down. First first down of the game. Huge play right here. Watch Brock Purdy. Watch his eyes. He's going to look over to the right side of the field. Look over. Doesn't like it. Doesn't panic. Keeps his eyes downfield. Give George Kittle a catchable ball. First down. Next play here. Super common concept. We got Mesh. Going to get a little drag here. A little drag here. Got a flat by CMC. Got Kittle on a corner. And then you got Ayuk coming right here and curling it up right in the middle of everything. So what Brock Purdy's reading right here. One, two, three, four. If he likes the corner pre-snap, he can take it. If not, then he just goes through his regular mesh. You're going to watch it play out here. It's pretty easy to see. You're going to see the flat get taken away. CMC's taken. See it right here? Covered. Then your eyes come to the mesh right here. You're going to see the Eagles struggle to pass this off. Leaves a wide open hole for Debo to run into. Get it in Debo's hands and let him do Debo things. Another first down. Let's go. Watch how decisive Purdy is right here. Right when he sees it, boom, ball. Right on his face mask. Great, great job. Next play here, got a little concept the 49ers love to run. They got a little drift or glance post right here. We then have CMC coming out the backfield on a corner. And then we have this guy motioning across and just getting out into the flat to try to pull these guys out of the way so they can throw this post. Party loves to throw this post. He throws it with good anticipation. He's confident in it. But this time, the Eagles do a good job covering it up. The, the safety stays in the middle of the field. So Purdy has to come off of it, but as he comes off of it, he gets pressure. There's a great job right here stepping up in the pocket, seeing green grass, breaking a tackle, and going and getting six yards. Next play here, we just got a beautiful design by Kyle Shanahan. Oh, we're going to get Debo Samuel's going to come in motion. He's going to give you an orbit motion, so he's going to come behind Brock Purdy. Purdy's going to turn his back to the defense and act like he's handing it off to Debo right here, but then he's going to roll out. And we're going to have Jawan Jennings coming on a flat, or he's coming underneath right here. He's trying to sneak out. And you have Brandon Ayuk coming on top of it. So when Purdy rolls out here, he's just looking one here, two here, and then three would be his legs. Watch it play out here. You're going to see whenever he gives this fake to Debo, everyone's going to flow with it. Everyone's flowing with it. You see the flow of defenders. And then Ayuk's going to come right over the top of it. And Jawan Jennings is trying to slip through right here. And that way... He's flowing with the run, so Purdy's able to get outside of him, and you don't have to block him. Works out perfectly here. Look at the flat. It's covered. Come back to Brandon Ayuk, top of the screen. He's there. Put it on him. Touchdown, Niners. Next play here, another great design by Shanahan. All we got, we're going to get Debo motioning across on that orbit again. Brock Purdy's going to turn his back to the defense, act like he's handing that off, but he's just going to fake it. And then we have George Kittle coming on a dig right here. Then we have CMC coming behind him on, a, on the second dig. And then we have Ayuk down below clearing everything out. We're going to give this fake. 
with the goal of pulling these linebackers up, and then we're going to try to throw it right behind them into an open window, and that's exactly what happens. Play works out to perfection, exposing these Philly linebackers. George Kittle, I mean, he's wide open. You see that run right there, how much he respects it. He has to step up for it, leaves this huge window to throw into. Purdy makes sure he puts it on him. Easy catch. Let George Kittle get some yardage after it. Next play here, another great job by Brock Purdy. All we got, we got an out up top. If you like it pre-snap, let's take it. Purdy doesn't like that. So on this top side up here, we got a go by Debo, clearing out. And then underneath it, we got Brandon Ayuk coming on an out route right here. Then we have George Kittle helping in the block. And he's going to get out and come here as your number three, or number two. So it's just one to two. Pretty simple. If Brock Purdy throws this ball any later, it's going to be picked off. Puts it around the money, though, on time. Another big, big chunk. Now, usually, if I'm just going to be honest, Brock Purdy does throw with a little bit more anticipation with this, but he still gets it out in good enough timing to make Brandon Ayuk be able to catch it before it gets picked off. Another big chunk. Next play here, another beautifully drawn-up play by Shanahan. All we got, we got a go here by Kittle. But Kittle's goal right here is to get in the way of this corner that's guarding Jawan Jennings. So Jawan Jennings is going to come out and then cut across his face like this. And when this guy, this corner, sticks out like this, Kittle's going to make sure he gets in his way, get a little natural rub, and it's going to leave Jawan Jennings wide open across the field because they're in man coverage. Watch it here. Great design. Purdy does a great job executing it. Boom. Look at that window. <laughs> Look at that window to throw into. So much grass. Love to see it. Big play. Watch the rub work right here. George Kittle coming out of his break. Get in that guy's way. You see George Kittle getting in this corner's way, making it look natural. Just going to run his seam. Then he's going to cut right underneath it and obviously be wide open like we just saw. Easy, easy money. Next play here. This play right here is just meant straight up for CMC if you catch him in man coverage. Right here, the Eagles, they're just straight cover one. Manned here, manned here, manned here, manned here, manned here. One high safety in the middle of the field. So, you have what you're looking for. CMC here, all we got, we're going to get a little motion. And when he bumps out with him to follow him, that tells you that they're 100% in man. CMC, at the snap of the ball, going to run up. Act like he's running an option route. But when he cuts out, he's just going to turn it upfield, run a little out and up absolutely destroys the linebacker. We have a post up top to take everything away, to clear everything out. Watch CMC, boom, kills him. Purdy lets the ball out on time, puts it right on the money, puts him in the red zone. Next play here, all we got is a little smash up top. So we got corner by Kittle, got flat underneath it by CMC. And then on the back side, if you don't like this smash concept up here, we're motioning use check out, getting him on a little slant. We have Debo on a little bit deeper, like Glance. Then we have Ronnie Bell coming on like a drift post right in the middle. So you have the smash concept. If you don't like it, you can come one to two to three on the backside. So watch it pan out here. Purdy's going to look up at the top of the screen. Doesn't like it. Comes back to Ronnie Bell. Doesn't like it. Comes back to Debo. Puts it on him. And then that's when you just let Debo do Debo things. <laughs> and he goes, goes and scores a touchdown on a five-yard catch. Obviously, Debo does a great job after the catch, but this play happens because of Purdy. Looks at the smash, doesn't like it. Looks at Ronnie Bell, doesn't like it. Comes back to Debo, puts on his face mask. Just put it in your guys' hands and let him make plays. Great job going through the whole progression, and it ends up being a touchdown. Next play here. This right here is an amazing job by Brock Purdy. 49ers know this slot corner, Eli Ricks, is the Eagles' weak link. So that's who Purdy's going to target. We got to go by Debo. Then we just got a curl by Jawan Jennings, and we're trusting that uh, Jawan Jennings is going to win one-on-one -on -one with him because the Eagles are once again in straight man coverage for some reason. What's so good about this is Brock Purdy's timing because he throws it with such anticipation that the robber doesn't have a chance to get underneath it. So this guy right here is coming. He's the robber. He's just looking at Brock Purdy's eyes. This guy, like I said, has the curl right here. So you have to get this ball out early, so this guy can't drift underneath it, and that's exactly what Brock Purdy does. The ball's already out. You probably can't see it on the screen, but it's right here. 
And this guy ain't even out of his break yet. Juwan Jennings ain't even out of his break. The ball comes out a little bit high, but Juwan Jennings does win on the route, makes a great catch, and Brock Purdy gives the robber no chance to make a play. Great job. Next play here, we're going to catch the Eagles in a zero blitz. All these guys right here, they're coming. If, he, if CMC goes out, this guy's going to peel with him, but everybody else is coming. They're all coming. But Purdy ain't scared of it. All we got, go by Debo, clearing out. We have an out coming underneath it. Once again, mismatch right here. Big mismatch. The 49ers like that. You have Kittle coming across like he's running a crosser. He's going to get back like this. And then you have uh, Brandon Ayuk on a dig behind it all. So if you were to go through it, it would be one to the out, two here, and then three to this backside dig. But like I said, we got a mismatch on Jawan Jennings. So Brock Purdy feels the pressure. You see everyone coming. The pocket's collapsing. Doesn't matter to Purdy. Already releasing the ball. Not even out of his break yet. Purdy puts it on him. And then Jawan Jennings makes the guy miss and goes and scores a touchdown. Watch Brock Purdy right here. Not phased by the blitz at all. Put it on him. Make him miss. Go score a touchdown. Let's go. So overall, man, Brock Purdy, another dominant performance from him. Getting the ball in his playmaker's hands. Going through his progressions. Not letting pressure get to him. All of the above, the dude is playing out of his mind right now. And you could say the same for this whole 49ers team because they probably look like the best team in the NFL. But I hope you enjoyed the film breakdown. If you did, feel free to hit that subscribe button. And until next time, I'll catch you guys in the next one.